यार एक बार मेरे को बताना तुम्हारा जो लास्ट नेम है उसको प्रोनाउंस कैसे करते हो तातेर 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 करते हैं ना ठीक है ठीक है काफी कंफ्यूजन रहता चलो ठीक है स्टार्ट करते हैं हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल एंड टुडे वी हैव निखिल तातेर विद अस He has qualified his uh, chartered accountancy in December twenty one. Right now, he is doing a job in L and T. He has got placed in ICI campus through Noida location. Let's hear more about Nikhil from him only. Nikhil. Yeah. Hi. Hi, everyone. Like uh, my name is Nikhil Tatir, and uh, I have qualified my chartered accountancy accountancy in December twenty one, and uh, I got placed through. I say campus placement program uh, uh, into Larsen and Tubro Limited, and I am currently placed at uh, at a project location uh, which is near Central Secretariat, Delhi. Mm -hmm. And uh, basically, my work involves uh, revolves around uh, MIS reporting, cash flows, and budgeting, etc. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, Nikhil, uh, uh, have you done your article ship from a big four or a normal mid size firm? Actually, I did my article ship from T R Chetty and Company Limited. It is uh, although not a big four, but it is a top twenty audit firms. Mm -hmm. And I did my article ship in internal auditing and statutory auditing both. Okay, I had also given an interview for T R Chetty, but then I got rejected. But <laughs> okay. Uh, so, uh, Nikhil, how was the uh, how is the work culture over? in uh, lnt are they very cooperative to you or what kind of culture they, do they have like they have very inclusive work culture like uh, they welcome the new joiners and uh, they'll guide you properly so there is no such issue with the seniors as such okay so everybody is approachable if you yeah yeah sure okay we can okay. approach everybody yeah mm hmm uh so how did you get to this uh, lnt through ici campus right yeah through I ici campus only uh, there are two rounds of interviews like first round is a psychometric test basically which has two parts uh, first one was english and another one was a quantitative aptitude so in english they will ask you basic general grammatical questions in the psychometric test and in in the quantitative aptitude they basically uh, at my time they asked me the questions uh, the, uh, it, it was a series uh, pattern series uh, questions like you will be given few patterns and you have to guess what will come after that so after the psychometric test if you clear that uh, they will be having a personal interview round in which they'll for basically firstly they will ask you about your article ship and uh, after the after they are satisfied with the questions uh, then they will go to uh, after article ship experience they will go to your they will ask you to choose a profile they will throw some profiles on you like uh, if you want to go to treasury if you want to go to project accounting if you want to go to uh, direct taxation and direct taxation they'll ask you like you choose one and when you choose one of the profiles they'll ask you questions around that profile only and that uh, if they are satisfied with the answers they will give you a nod like you are selected okay so there is only one round of interview there is no hr interview anything like that no no there there was only one round of interview that was personal interview okay after the psychometric so, test okay so let's suppose you chose for the uh, direct taxation so will your role will be direct taxation or uh, it can be anything else sorry let's suppose you gave the choice of direct taxation into your interview and you got mm -hmm. selected so will you get direct taxation as your role or any another role no they uh, they'll give you direct taxation only if they are asking you the profile it means there is a vacancy in that profile only so you are selected for that profile only which you choose at the interview stage okay okay uh, what is your work profile over in rnt 
my pro work profile is project accounting, which I mentioned. So basically, I am at a uh, construction site wherein we handle the accounts part. Okay, so basically most of your work involves around accounting, cash flows of the construction sites only. Yes, yes. Okay, okay. Uh, so Nikhil, do you remember any of the questions that were asked during your uh, interviews? Uh, firstly, during the articleship experience questions, like uh, they basically asked me the uh, procurement to pay process. Like I mentioned, mm -hmm. like uh, that I have done internal auditing for one year. So they went into procurement to pay process. They, they asked me around that questions. And once I decided uh, project accounting, they asked me questions around standard costing. So what is basically standard costing, mm -hmm. how it is relevant. That is what they asked. Okay. So majorly most of the questions were around from your uh, CV only. Nothing exceptional or anything yes, like that. Sir. Okay. Okay. No. Uh, so, uh, Nikhil, after working around uh, so many days, I would say, or months with LNT, can you give us uh, any bonus tip to the CA freshers who will be sitting for the LNT interviews so that they can excel in their interview? Basically, uh, just be confident about yourself and uh, do a little bit of research like go on their page know what they do like they have built uh excellent excellent uh milestone projects like uh statue of unity uh motera stadium the narendra modi stadium that we have built so you can go through the uh, the website of lnt and know what they are doing and uh, you'll get to know more about the company as well read financials like just go through the annual report once if you can. So it would be more than enough to crack the interview. Okay. One more thing, Nikhil. Um, RNT is more into constructions, right? And we have uh, revenue recognition for uh, construction in 115 somewhat. Yes. So do they ask questions relating to that or do you use that kind of accounting into your general uh, work in, 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 at RNT? Yes, uh, the basically the two most uh, used standards here are uh, NDS one one five and NDS one one six. So they can ask you that uh, revenue recognition, like they can ask you the five step model. They didn't ask me the, in the interview, but first day I went there, I met my senior. He asked me about NDS one one five. So they might ask you even in the interview also. Okay. Okay. So apart from your CV, uh, 115 and 116 will be very important for the interviews, right? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Okay. Uh, so thank you, Nikhil. Uh, that's all that I have that I wanted to ask. I hope this video helps the other people who are watching this. Okay. Uh, thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you so much, Sudhanshu, and all the best to everyone who is going to give LNT interview. All the best. Yeah.